Located off the shore of Southeast Africa, Madagascar is the fourth largest island in the world and famous for being the only place on Earth where you can find lemurs in the wild. Unfortunately, the beauty and diversity of this country is in grave danger due to massive deforestation. Humans arrived in Madagascar roughly 2,000 years ago. Since then, about 90% of the island's forests have been destroyed. The main direct cause is the agricultural practices used on the island. The most common practice is known as the slash and burn technique. The farmers cut the trees and burn down a plot of land. The ash makes nutrient-rich soil that is great for fertilization and they can grow a lot of crops. This technique is extremely harmful and unsustainable. The plot only stays fertile for a couple of seasons, then the farmers have to move on and destroy even more forest. Additionally, this method releases more carbon into the air while at the same time destroying these giant trees which are extremely effective at absorbing CO2. While the farming practices may be the most direct cause, the underlying cause of deforestation is the extreme poverty in Madagascar. Agriculture is the major industry on the island, and a lack of proper materials has led to desperation and a need to destroy the environment to survive. The seclusion of Madagascar contributes significantly to the beauty of the island, but due to its lack of resources, its remoteness could be its demise. The major impact that the deforestation has is on the wildlife, as it poses a huge threat to biodiversity. Biodiversity is the variety of life on Earth. It includes all of the species, biomes, and ecosystems. Madagascar is a biodiversity hotspot because 90% of the species are endemic to the island, meaning that there are over 11,000 species that you can only find on Madagascar. Deforestation is threatening biodiversity, destroying habitats, and endangering the stability of a wide range of species. This topic is important first and foremost because Catholic social teaching calls upon us to care for God's creation. Since humans have arrived in Madagascar, at least 15 species of lemurs have gone extinct and are now named the most endangered mammal in the world. Caring for God's creation includes caring for the variety of animals that make our gorgeous ecosystems possible. The World Wildlife Fund has lemur socks that can be purchased and all proceeds go to protecting these endangered creatures. Additionally, you could go the extra mile and adopt a lemur. All funds would go to the same cause. There are also other ways to support the impoverished in Madagascar. If you ever find yourself visiting the island, ecotourism helps to make your experience unique as well as supporting the local communities. While this topic may seem limited to a single island, its effects are being and will continue to be felt globally. This will not go away and it's time to take action.